Number 25 Texas women's basketball lost to unranked Texas Tech. The final score was 68-64. What exactly happened? First of all, Texas scored 27 points in the first half. Texas Tech scored 30. Second half, 38 points for Texas Tech and 37 for, for Texas. So, I mean, it's pretty, cl pretty close. I mean, but here's the deal. Texas didn't shoot well from three. Oh, but overall they did, 42.4 percent, 28 for 66 on three pointers, six for 23, 26.1 percent. And you're gonna get the job done. And the thing is, five of those threes came from two players, two of them. Two for six on free throws. If you make your free throws, you're going to go overtime. But that's how it's not 2020. 36 rebounds, 15 of those offensive, 15 assists. Four steals, six blocks, 15 turnovers, 24 fouls, and they did have 15 points off the bench. Texas Tech had 17 points off the bench. I mean, Texas Tech shot 40.8% 40, from the field, 20 for 49. 17 less shots, but somehow they won the game. Six for 14 on threes, which is 42.9%. 22 for 30 on free throws, which is 73.3%. 35 rebounds, 11 of those offensive. Yes, they got out-rebounded, but it's only by one. 11 assists. They had 11 steals in the game. Four blocks. 14 turnovers. 13 fouls. So what do these two teams have going forward? Well, Texas has to play Baylor, who is receiving votes, and, and if they would have been... If the rankings would have gone to like 30 or 35, Baylor would be number 26. So that's not going to be an easy game. Then Texas gets to host number 15, Oklahoma. Then you got Oklahoma State, which back-to-back -back home games after that Baylor game is helpful, but it's not easy games by any means. It isn't. And then you, you got West Virginia at West Virginia, which, you know... That's a difficult place to play. And you got at Kansas. And Kansas is going to be fired up, especially after losing to them. I guarantee that. Now, Tex Tech, but on the other hand, has the following games. At West Virginia. That's the battle of two teams that are outside looking in for the NCAA tournament right now. I can promise you that. But that's a long way away, I know, to talk about. But you get, you get the host, Baylor. That's number 26. Which, they if they beat Texas, Baylor does, they're going to be ranked again. So, then you got at Oklahoma State. You got... Kansas State, that's 12 and 7. They're outside looking in for the NCAA tournament, too. And then you got Texas again, but this time in Austin. So, not a lot of easy games, so to speak. So, anyways, if you like this content, hit the like and subscribe button. I'll see you guys later. It's going to be 500 subscribers. We're on the road to it. Let's go.